Welcome to Second Coming at 60. When we read 2 Thessalonians chapter 2, we find a few descriptions of the substitute Christ. Most notably, we discover that he sits in the temple of God, a symbol of the Christian church, and he proclaims himself God on earth. We also learn that he comes with the workings of Satan, which are listed as all power, signs, lying wonders, and all unrighteous deception. This sounds like scary stuff. In fact, Jesus even warns us that if possible, even the elect might be deceived. But the good news here is found in verse 8 when Jesus says that this substitute Christ will be destroyed by the brightness of his coming. Paul gives the glory to the spirit of God's mouth, which is the holy word. Now in verse 1, if you're scared, you've got some good news there because we find out that we are gathered together to Christ. So look up, lift up our heads, because our redemption draws near.